the types of microorganisms that live on our skin. Bacteria. Most of the bacteria that live on our skin are harmless. However, some can occasionally cause health issues. Cutibacterium acnes. These bacteria live on oily surfaces of your skin and hair follicles, and they feed on the sebum that is produced by the sebaceous glands. They can cause acne breakouts because they multiply when there is excess oil production and clogged pores. Corine bacteria. Corine bacteria includes non-pathogenic and pathogenic bacteria. Some produce toxins that can lead to diphtheria. However, on the skin, they are mostly harmless and are essential to maintain a balanced microbiome. Staphylococcus epidermides Usually considered one of the good guys on the skin, it produces a series of antimicrobial peptides that keep other pathogens under control. There is also evidence of its positive effect on the skin through the modulation of the inflammatory response. Staphylococcus aureus, often found in the nasal cavities and respiratory tract and spread through physical contact. This bacteria can cause staphylococcal scalded skin syndrome, cellulitis or eczema. Micrococcus luteus. This is a very common microorganism of the skin and is usually considered beneficial but can become a pathogen when the environment is appropriate. Lactobacilli, a well-known microorganism with beneficial effects for the gut and vagina. Recent studies have also highlighted that certain species are linked to healthy skin. The absence of this bacteria is associated with atopic dermatitis and psoriasis. Fungi there are skin fungi present at 14 different places across the body, between the eyebrows, ear canal, back of the head, behind the ears, heel, toenails, between the toes, back, groin, forearm, nostrils, chest, palms, crook of the elbow. The heel alone has around 80 different species of fungi. Viruses the most common viruses on the skin are bacteriophages that infect skin bacteria so they play an essential role in the regulation of the skin microbiota. Human viruses such as herpes or the virus causing warts and verrucas are also common. Archaea As one of the three taxonomic domains, archaea are a substantial component in areas of the human body, such as the nose, lung, gut and skin. They resemble bacteria in their shape and size, and they make up around 12% of the human microbiome. However, archaea are relatively understudied due to methodical problems, so not much is known about them. Mites Mites are also a part of the skin's microbiome. For example, Demodex is the name given to small mites that live in hair follicles. In humans, these are usually found in facial hair and can sometimes cause a condition known as dermodycosis. They feed on dead skin cells and can exacerbate pre-existing skin conditions in large numbers. 